The vast oceans, once barriers between nations, are now avenues of approach for potential threats. These waters, stretching endlessly, are both a source of opportunity and vulnerability. To protect their fleets and coastlines, countries rely on sophisticated defense systems. These systems are the first line of defense, ensuring the safety of maritime borders and the security of naval operations. Among the most crucial components are surface-to-air missiles, or SAMs. These advanced weapons are essential for maintaining air superiority and safeguarding naval assets. These missiles are designed to intercept and destroy airborne threats, acting as a shield against enemy aircraft and missiles. Their precision and speed make them formidable defenders in any naval conflict. In this exploration, we delve into the capabilities of two such guardians, the American RIM-67 Standard, also known as the SM-2, and the Indo-Israeli Barak-8 MRSM. Each of these systems brings unique strengths to the table. These missiles represent the cutting edge of naval air defense technology. They are the result of years of research, development, and testing. They are marvels of engineering, capable of engaging multiple targets at extreme ranges. Their advanced guidance systems ensure accuracy and effectiveness in high-stakes scenarios. Understanding their strengths and weaknesses provides valuable insight into the complex world of naval warfare. This knowledge is crucial for developing strategies and ensuring the continued protection of our seas. The RIM-67 standard, often referred to as the SM-2, has been a cornerstone of the United States Navy's air defense for decades. This missile system has played a crucial role in ensuring the safety and security of naval operations, providing a reliable shield against aerial threats. Developed by Raytheon, the SM-2 is a multi-generational family of missiles, each iteration improving upon the last. Over the years, advancements in technology and engineering have allowed the SM-2 to evolve, enhancing its capabilities and effectiveness in various combat scenarios. This essay will focus on the SM-2ER, or Extended Range Variant, one of the most capable versions currently in service. The SM-2ER has been specifically designed to address long-range threats, making it an indispensable asset for naval defense. The SM-2ER boasts an impressive range, exceeding 90 nautical miles, allowing it to engage threats far from its launching ship. This extended range provides a significant tactical advantage, enabling naval forces to neutralize potential dangers before they can pose a direct threat. It achieves this range through a two-stage propulsion system, consisting of a solid fuel booster for initial acceleration and a powerful solid fuel rocket motor for sustained flight. This combination ensures that the missile can reach its target with both speed and precision. The SM-2ER is guided to its target using a combination of inertial guidance and semi-active radar homing. This sophisticated guidance system allows the missile to maintain accuracy even in challenging conditions, ensuring that it can effectively engage and destroy its target. This means the launching ship illuminates the target with its radar and the missile homes in on the reflected signal. This method of guidance not only enhances the missile's accuracy, but also allows for real-time adjustments during flight, increasing the likelihood of a successful interception. On the other side of the world, a significant development is taking place in the field of naval air defense. A new player has emerged in this critical domain, the Barak 8 MR SAM. This advanced missile system is the result of a joint venture between Israel Aerospace Industries and India's Defense Research and Development Organization. The Barak 8 is a testament to the growing collaboration between these two nations in the defense sector. The MR in its designation stands for medium range, indicating its intended operational envelope. While it may not boast the same extreme range as the SM-2ER, it is designed to meet specific tactical needs. The Barak 8 MR SAM still packs a significant punch. With a range exceeding 40 nautical miles, it provides a robust defensive perimeter around its host ship. This missile system is not just about range, it's about precision and reliability. The Barak 8 employs a sophisticated active radar homing system. This means the missile carries its own radar, 
allowing it to independently track and engage targets without relying on continuous illumination from the launching ship. This capability enhances its effectiveness in complex combat scenarios. The Barak 8 MR SAM is a versatile and powerful addition to any naval fleet, ensuring that ships are well protected against aerial threats. Its development marks a significant milestone in international defense cooperation. Comparing the RIM-67 standard or SM-2ER and the Barak 8 MR SAM reveals distinct strengths and weaknesses. The SM-2ER reigns supreme in terms of range, reaching out over twice as far as the Barak 8 missile. This extended reach is crucial for engaging threats early and preventing them from closing in on the fleet. However, the Barak 8's active radar homing system provides a significant advantage in terms of target engagement flexibility. It allows the Barak 8 to operate independently once fired, freeing up the launching ship's radar for other critical tasks and increasing survivability in a congested combat environment.